Argentina. Why is China signing the JF-17 agreement? JF-17 has achieved another success and Pakistan has got another buyer. This time the deal has gone through some interesting stages as Argentina chose the Russian MiG-35 and JF-17 to buy new fighter jets. After which one of the two was to be purchased. So it can be said that in the global market, JF-17 not only defeated the Indian Tejas but also the MiG-35. It makes sense to beat Tejas, but why not buy a MiG-35 compared to JF-17? In addition, information on why JF-17's deal is being done by China instead of Pakistan is also available in this article. In recent days, it has been reported that Argentina will replace the Mirage with MiG-35 or JF-17, which has now been confirmed, as Argentina has decided to buy about 12 units of the JF-17. In this regard, some people from China have gone to Argentina who will finalize this deal. This deal is being done by China instead of Pakistan for a special reason. Argentina had previously wanted to buy F-A-50 aircraft manufactured by Korean Aerospace Industries, but the aircraft could not be sold to Argentina after being banned by the UK, due to the fact that the aircraft UK parts are also used. The reason for the ban is some differences between Britain and Argentina. Now Pakistan-UK relations are such that Pakistan does not want the UK to show resentment as a result of this deal, so this deal is being done here through China. Now the UK will not be able to object to this deal between Pakistan and Argentina because China has a role to play in making JF-17 and it has the right to sell JF-17 to whomever it wants with the permission of Pakistan. Whether Pakistan sells JF-17 or China. The profit on each deal and the cost of building the aircraft are predetermined. Which falls to both countries. JF-17 was also sold to Myanmar by China. Argentina has been interested in JF-17 for the last few years and probably some people from Argentina also came to Pakistan in 2017 to buy these planes who had to test the plane. Meanwhile, Argentina was in contact with Israel, but Israeli planes were not purchased. According to the Argentine Air Force, it is interested in JF-17 Block 3. The question now is whether Russia offered its own MiG-35 to Argentina. But why choose JF-17 instead of buying this fighter jet? So there is a reason. And that's because the weapon package, the deal is not just for the planes, but for the missiles and other weapons used. And if you look at JF-17's weapon package at the moment, all kinds of weapons are included in the weapons of this aircraft. The MiG-35 is a dual-engine aircraft and has a higher payload capacity than the JF-17. Unfortunately, this excellent fighter has not found a buyer to date. The JF-17 is a low-cost aircraft and costs less to maintain. The performance of this single-engine aircraft is very good compared to its price. This is one of the main reasons why Argentina has chosen JF-17 over the MiG-35. The MiG-35 is considered a 4 plus generation aircraft while the JF-17 Block 3 is a 4 plus generation aircraft. The top speed of MiG-35 is 2.2 Mach and the top speed of Block 3 will be 2 Mach. The combat range of MiG-35 is said to be 1,000 km while that of Block 2 is 1,350 km. And Block 3 will be even more so. The MiG-35 has 9 hard points while the Block 3 has 8. If the MiG-35 can fire short-range R-77s in aerial combat, then the JF-17 is equipped with the new generation, PLTNE. JF-17 is also not far behind in its ability to hit long distances. The MiG-35 is equipped with R-77 missiles, one variant of which has a range of 80 km and the other up to 193 km. The Block 3 can be equipped with Place 15 missiles with a range greater than R-77. The JF-17 is also equipped with better and longer range weapons than the MiG-35. These include supersonic and subsync missiles. As far as radar is concerned, Block 3 has installed KLJ-7A radar which not only supports Chinese weapons but also has modes that support Western weapons. Thus, any country that buys JF-17 will be able to equip it with Western weapons. Here, Block 3 has the upper hand over the MiG-35. The planes that Argentina first tried to buy could be sued by Western weapons, suggesting that Argentina needed a plane that could fire Western weapons. JF-17 can be sold to Argentina with a special configuration, whether it is equipped with Chinese weapons or Western. 
JF-17 Block Building will continue and old blocks can be equipped with new systems. Even Block 2 can be upgraded to Block 3 standard. Thanks for watching my video please subscribe my channel goodbye.